Welcome back, friends. This is Sam the Snowman. It was written by Susan Wingett. And he discovers the magic of giving. Hmm. You're excited as I am. I love snow stories. Sam, the little snowman, knows the secret of making snow is something called the magic of giving. All the other snow children do it easily, but Sam can't even make one snowflake. Now one day, his teacher says the children of Countyville are waiting for their first winter snow. I'd like you to help them, Sam. I know you can do it. Now down in Countryville, Sarah and her brother Tom visit their friends in the brown cold woods. Everyone is wishing for snow so they can play when dot dot dot. I wonder what'll happen. What do we see in this picture? They look so surprised. They hear a sudden whoosh and Sam introduces himself and he says, I'm here to bring the snow. As bravely as he can, Sarah and Tommy cheer. But Sam is having trouble. Lots of trouble. It's not working. I knew I couldn't do it, Sam says sadly. Sarah and Tommy rush to comfort him. Sarah has a holly leaf for Sam's hat. Tommy gives the little snowman a scarf to cheer him up. Sam feels so much better as he walks his new friends home. Now the children's gifts have made Sam feel warm and happy inside. He wants to give them something in return. He decides to try making snow one more time and he raises his broom. Wishing hard, Sam gives it the best twirl. And it works. He paints the sky and makes the woods and town sparkle. Sam can't wait to share the snow with Sarah and Tommy. They hurry to the woods where the bears are sledding. The birds are singing. The foxes are frolicking. And the skating is fine. Everyone is happy on this perfect snowy day. Sam is the happiest of all. Now he understands the magic of giving. And that's the end of Sam the Snowman. Stay tuned because I have a story about a hundred snowmen. If you haven't heard it and it excites you, stay tuned because it's coming next.